You're Moses. You're on the top of the mountain. What did God just give you? He gave you ta two tablets with the word of God written in his own finger. And what did you do with it? You dropped it. From then till now, Jewish people have been searching for a way to keep Deuteronomy 6. Because what does God say to them in Deuteronomy 6? Deuteronomy 6, God says, put it on your heart. He says, put it on your head. He says, put it on your arm. Put it on your doorpost. Put it on the gate to your city. We've been able to synthesize the entire Word of God, the whole Bible, into a 4.77 by 4.77 silicon chip where the entire text is written on it. And now people are using it in different ways. They're putting it on jewelry. They're putting it in gifts. They're using it for premiums for their networks, for their churches, to grow their ministries, homeschooling children, uh, graduation rings, cufflinks, different ways of carrying the Word of God with us 24-7 in fulfillment of Deuteronomy 6. So the entire past, present, and future of Israel is right here in a 4.77 by 4.77 millimeter chip. Now why did we get Nano Dot Bible? First of all, the minute I saw the sign, Dot Bible, I already knew that we we're getting Nano Dot Bible. Nano means small, that's all it means. But it has a huge impact on people's, because they know nanotechnology is the future. Nanotechnology is, everything is run on nanotechnology. And we are the Nano Bible. So Nano Dot Bible is just the, uh, an obvious, it's brilliant. I'm so thankful for you for creating it and uh, for making it available. And uh, where else could you get a four, a four letter uh, prefix to your website? So Nanobot Bible will be the place where all of the amazing things that people are making will be linked. Uh, all the different stores of all the different jewelers, all the different um, uh, gifts that people are giving, all the different places. And the Museum of the Bible is the, is the home. So the Museum of the Bible will have an exhibit on the, on the Jerusalem Nano Bible, which is the smallest, the smallest exhibit in the museum. And uh, they'll have their own line of jewelry, they'll have their own line of gifts and uh, it'll all be available from the Museum of the Bible at nano.bible.